The new university semester is a month old here in South Korea, and many students are facing high food costs caused by inflation. Her Park Geun went out to find out how they are dealing the issue. At 8 a.m. in a cafeteria inside a university located in Seoul, many students start lining up to have their breakfast. Uh, the meal here is only a thousand won. I, I come here pretty much every day of the week. This meal, which costs only 75 cents under a governmental project, so that students can get a healthy breakfast at a reasonable price, is one way university students in South Korea are lowering food expenses at a time of high prices. But as the only meal available under this program is breakfast, and as data from Statistics Korea showed that dining out prices rose 3.8 percent on year in February, marking 33 straight months of increases, students are figuring out other ways to cope. Convenience stores are another option for university students who want a cheap meal. This lunchbox costs around 5,000 won, or in U.S. dollars, about $3.70. And convenience stores are also launching promotions to make such food items even cheaper. But students I spoke to said it is not easy for them to budget for food. After entering university, there are occasions where I have to eat out and drink in order to make more friends. Freshmen are spending more due to social gatherings where they can make new friends. I spend about $750 this month as I participated in gatherings and as people tend to order and spend more at those gatherings because we usually split the bill. Some said they make their own food at home or sometimes even skip meals when they do not have engagements to lower expenses. One concerned professor said more support is needed. The government should be actively supporting university students who are our future workers, although they might not have income right now. She added, local governments should support restaurants near universities, including helping with electricity bills so that they could lower food prices and that those restaurants should be monitored to ensure they do so. Park Geun-woo, Arirang News.